I thought I'd share some of my giveaway wins and actually unbox these wins with you. I'm new into comping. I've been really inspired by all the fellow compers out there. So I received this parcel from Matcha and Beyond on Instagram. It was a an Instagram giveaway and I had to create a matcha bowl as part of a as part of their creative entry. I took part and luckily I won. And I think they were so let's open it. Um yeah they were giving away some of their culinary grade matcha. So look it's really nicely packaged. There we go, matcha and beyond. Spread the matcha love. Congratulations, Lila. There we go. Um, yeah, nice. So let's unpack it together. And here we are. My matcha powder. So it's 70 grams of, again, like I said, culinary grade matcha. So it's ideal for baking. And I, it's, yeah, it's 100% matcha green tea and comes from Japan. So, yeah, I'm really excited to try this, actually. Um, I've got a few ideas on how to use this. Yeah, in cakes and baking and whatnot. So that'd be nice. Another win, actually, I wanted to share with you um, was through the Skittles Instant Win Prize that they run daily. I'm not sure, I can't remember when that one ends. So I've been trying it for quite a while and I've just, I kept getting the sorry, unlucky this time or whatever message comes up that you didn't win. But eventually, um, I won £20 with them. So that was a lovely win. It hasn't come through into my account yet, but they do say it takes 28 days. So hoping that that will come through soon. But yeah, that's exciting. My first cash prize, I guess. But yeah, that's that's it from me for now. Hi again. So before I dive into another unboxing with you, I just thought I'd share this drink with you. They're called Punchy. And I've never heard of them before, but I really wanted to sort of try it for the first time with you guys to sort of give you a bit of a review. Um, I bought this from uh, that bakery called Ol and Steen or something like that. I um, can't remember. Anyway, I never really go in there. But the reason I did was because I'm not sure if you guys have heard of the cashback app called Green Gin. So Green Gin is a, um, a cashback app that sometimes lets you try new products for free or for a discounted price. By the way, this isn't sponsored by Green Gin or anything. I just wanted to share that with you because I love trying new drinks and everything. So when I found this, I was like, ooh, let me see, let me just share that with my viewers, <laughs> with my one viewer out there. But um, but yeah, just it's meant to have, so it's apparently it's got blood orange bitters, which are great for digestion, and cardamom. And as you've seen from my previous videos, I'm really into trying to lead a more gut healthy lifestyle. So let's, let's go ahead and... And try it. Ooh. I do love that sound. Hmm, actually, not bad. It's not sweet. It's very subtle, and I like a, a subtle drink. So, so there you go. If you do have the Green Gin app, make sure you pop to your nearest Olenstein Bakery, whatever that name of that bakery is, and grab one because I think they're free at the moment. So. Yum. Right, let's go and unbox this next giveaway win. Ta-da! So this is like a big box for me and I was like, oh, this is exciting. I'm pretty sure I know where this, who this is from because I'm not an avid comper, so I'm only just starting, so I can't lose track of all my wins so far. But, um, which, I mean, I say that with caution because obviously you're always, I'm always so lucky I even get selected as a winner. So I'm like, ah, it's like Christmas day. But anyway, let's open this up. And I'm pretty sure, as I told you, this is a, uh, yes, it is. So, um, so yeah, this is a recent win that I won on Instagram from Wild Cornwall. And so yeah, this is from a small sustainable Cornish farm. I'm all about sustainability. 
and um, I do avidly talk about that subject on my blog. If you haven't checked it out, please do. I do sometimes review a lot of sustainable products on there. Anyway, that's for another another video. But um, yeah, so Wild Cornwall, they do luxury sauces and condiments and such. So using foraged ingredients. So I love that. I do forage myself. So it was quite a treat to win this one. So let's let's open it up. Here we go. Look, I'll open it with you. Sorry, there's kind of a weird camera setup here going on. Very sustainable packaging. No plastic in sight, which I like. Oh, why oh, this is so cool. Okay, so let's see. We've got a smoker box, ketchup. Oh my god, and it's made of glass. Look how nice the packaging is. So here we go. So this is using hedge grow, uh, an autumnal relish made with tart Cornish hawthorns, and our raw wildflower honey. How nice is this? Okay, I'm so excited. So ketchup. Oh, there's, there's another box in here. One second. Ooh. Okay, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Um, so yeah, I think I think in here should be a barbecue sauce, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, this is so lovely. Oh my gosh. Sorry. I just love all this. Um, yeah, here we go. Look. Look how nicely packaged it all is. Here we go. Sorry, my camera is absolutely awful. I do need to invest in a better one. But um, here we go. So burger relish using hedge grow again. Um, we've also got a barbecue rub. Here we go. And um, I love the um, actual jars they all come in because they can be reusable once it's all finished. So finally, like I said, I think barbecue sauce. There we go. And this is using wild Alexander's and Trelonk raw wildflower honey. And it's won a taste of the West silver medal. Mmm. I'm so, so, so excited. Thank you so much, Wild Cornwall, for my treats. They are going to go down quite well with the family. So, yeah, there we go. So I also wanted to share a little day trip I took with my family and my boyfriend to Poole. Um, we had a Virgin Experience Days voucher, which my mum gave me for my birthday and it was for a sea cruise experience. So it meant we had to take a boat from Pool Key. We were going to see bits of the Jurassic Coast, as you'll see in this video. And so we were headed to Swanage, which was this really cute town. It was giving me a lot of Wes Anderson vibes. We had a couple of hours of just wandering around Swanage, but the tickets also included a trip on a steam train. So this was a particularly vintage and Victorian steam train. So it felt really cool being on it. It was like stepping back in time and almost like you're on the Hogwarts Express. <laughs> So that was really lovely. Honestly, it was such, such a lovely day trip and we had such a nice time that I kind of wanted to put it in here because A, just to keep track of it and just to share it with you and hopefully encourage you to also look at all those Virgin Experience Days or Groupon type vouchers out there that offer these sort of experiences because they're fun and obviously you're getting it at a much better price than paying full price if you're getting it off their website. So yeah, it was amazing and hope you enjoy my little vlog. <laughs>